Well, it's, how could I explain it? It's very beautiful. People tend to come in the summer and they see it at its very best. Or you often get people come in and they stay so long and then they leave. When you live up here, you have to be resilient and multitask. So the spaceport is just one more piece of multitasking. But there's such a rich history here. You've got Iron Age Brochs, you've got evidence of the Jacket White Rebellion, notorious clearances, and then you had the nuclear, then you had the oil industry. There's been change all the time here, and this is just another change. What about the environment? What about safety? Those were the things that came up at all the drop-ins and everybody's questions. And we wanted our environment protected as well. So we liked the ethos and the sort of what Orbex had to say, we agreed with. It was a sort of synergy between the two of us. And we thought if we have to have something industrial like that, we want it to be the best it can be for our land. It's a stunning landscape, isn't it? You come over the causeway from the Kyle of Tong and then go up the hill and all of a sudden you're faced with this vista and the mountains in the background. It's absolutely fantastic. Untouched for thousands of years, of course, and that's what everybody wants to see protected as we go forward. Where we're talking about is just a spot in the distance in the middle of nowhere. Uh, it's a mile from the road. It's a mile from anybody being able to set foot on anything that you don't sink in up to your knees. Uh, and that's where we're going to build a small launch pad to, to uh, launch our rockets from. And this is the amorphous living beast of, of a peat area like this. Uh, and that's what uh, everybody in granting us planning permission has been keen to protect. And it's what we're committed to make sure that we abide by all the rules and frameworks that have been set around us to safeguard all this peat for future generation. We know that if Orbex aren't successful with launching their rockets and things, then it's going to be a problem. I've seen what happened in Cornwall, and that's a hard blow to take, and I'm sure they worked really hard for their efforts. But I think they will be successful. I look to what happened in New Zealand with Rocket Lab and they've been successful, so why shouldn't we be successful?